What if I told you that scientists have just uncovered clues that might bring us closer to discovering extraterrestrial life? Welcome to today's episode, where we dive into a groundbreaking study on the possible Hycean atmosphere of exoplanet K218b. K218b is a fascinating exoplanet, located 124 light years away in the constellation Leo. This sub Neptune sized world has intrigued astronomers because it lies in the habitable zone of its star, meaning conditions might support liquid water and possibly even life. Unlike rocky exoplanets that resemble Earth, K218b has a hydrogen rich atmosphere and a large ocean beneath. This makes it one of the prime candidates for a new class of habitable exoplanets known as Hyson worlds hot, water rich planets with vast liquid oceans and thick hydrogen atmospheres. To unlock the secrets of K218b's atmosphere, scientists used the James Webb Space Telescope's powerful NIRIS and NARSPEC instruments. These advanced tools analyzed the light passing through the planet E's atmosphere as it transited in front of its star. By breaking this light into different wavelengths, astronomers were able to identify key molecular signatures. The observations spanned a wide range of infrared wavelengths, from 0.9 to 5.2 micrometers, providing an unprecedented look at the composition of K218b's atmosphere. This was crucial in identifying the specific gases present in the planet's atmosphere. The results? Absolutely stunning. Researchers found strong evidence of methane, CH4, and carbon dioxide, CO2, with concentrations around 1% each in a hydrogen-rich atmosphere. But there's more. No signs of ammonia, NH3, were detected, which aligns with predictions for an ocean-covered Hycean world. The detection of methane is particularly exciting because it resolves a long-standing mystery in exoplanet research, the missing methane problem seen in previous studies of exoplanets in similar conditions. The presence of CO2 alongside CH4 suggests a chemistry similar to what we might expect in an environment supporting life. And here's where it gets even more exciting. The data also suggests potential traces of dimethyl sulfide, DMS. On Earth, DMS is produced primarily by marine organisms. While not a confirmed biosignature yet, its presence is definitely worth investigating further. If future observations confirm the presence of DMS, it could be one of the strongest indicators yet that biological processes are taking place beyond Earth. Scientists will need additional data to determine whether this molecule is truly linked to biological activity or if alternative non-biological processes are responsible for its presence. So what does all this mean? These findings challenge our understanding of habitable worlds. Instead of just looking at rocky Earth-like planets, we now have strong reasons to explore Hyson worlds as potential cradles of life. This discovery suggests that our search for extraterrestrial life needs to expand beyond Earth-like conditions. A planet doesn't have to be just like Earth to be habitable. It could be a water world with a thick hydrogen atmosphere and still support life in ways we haven't even imagined. The journey isn't over yet. Future JWST observations, along with upcoming missions, will further investigate K218b's atmosphere and determine if these molecules hint at biological activity or alternative chemical processes. Upcoming telescopes, such as the Habitable Worlds Observatory and the Extremely Large Telescope, will provide even more detailed insights. These next-generation observatories will allow us to refine our understanding of exoplanet atmospheres and potentially confirm whether Hycean worlds can truly harbor life. The search for life beyond Earth is more exciting than ever. What do you think? Is K218b a true Hycean world, or are we seeing something entirely new? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more cosmic discoveries.